husband and wife. <laughs> hey, Judy, I hope your bag is in the car already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'll be waiting. Where you are going? When next are we seeing you? Ha! I don't know for now, but <laughs> it's, it's not a problem. That sounds like forever. Ha! Wifey! Uh, not to worry, eh? <laughs> she and I will be coming home for Easter to be with my man, Papa. Hey, this Easter? Yes. And then good then, Easter. Sweetheart, mm -hmm. Easter is very far. Mm -hmm. Eh? Yeah? No! Maybe he should pack his bag and come live with us permanently. Later this now. <laughs> it's a good idea. It's a very good you idea. Do, you know what to live with us. Okay, but I'm going to get Why? Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Don't worry, I'll miss you. You know what? Brother already said Easter, we're going to come. So we're going to see Easter. And that period, I'll be able to spend like four, five, six days or more days with you. Okay, with you guys. So they shall we? Yes, of course. to have missed my period for once since I married you. <laughs> Can you explain that? Yeah. How is this funny right now? I'm talking about my problem, you're laughing. Why, why is it funny to you? What is funny here? I want to have my own child just like every other woman out there. Make me miss my period, even if it's for once. Hey, Tineke. I can see you just like crying, but please. Don't disturb me with your tears. No, you lie. I will disturb you. I will. You think it's a joke? What is this now? You think it's a joke? You think it's a joke to make me miss my beard? I want to miss my beard. Make me miss Fujuma. my beard. What is this drama you're putting up? Make me miss my beard. Make me miss my beard. <laughs> Oh, okay, okay. I'm coming. I'm right behind you. Oh, mm -hmm. nice. <laughs> I always like coming here because it's so calm. Yeah. You know, you hear the sounds of the water and all mm -hmm. that. Um, so, what are you doing for your trip? Uh, I'll let you know when I'm ready. <laughs> Why can't you let me know now? Um, because I'm not certain yet. I have a lot of busy schedules on my decks. I need to clear them. When I'm done, I'll be able to know, okay, this is when I'm traveling or not. Okay. <laughs> hey, this reminds me. What? I've not called my wife for the last two days. I'm sure she'll be mad at me. You and this your brother's wife. You've not told me what is going on between the two of you. Do I? 
Do I sense jealousy? Jealousy? Me? Jealous of who? A married woman. <laughs> ah, well, at least. Oh, yes, at least she's official. Hmm? And she's le is Lego. You, you're an official, though. You know that. You're just being fiancé, fiancé. Well, everything can happen tomorrow. So you, you better you, you better to stop being jealous now. See what happens. <laughs> I know. Just a minute. <clears throat> Hey, wifey! You see, Chidi, I am done and dusted with this thing, with this sham called marriage. Alright? You and your brother have succeeded in pushing me out. I am leaving him for good. Okay? Yes! What is it? What is it? Uh, 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 hold on. Are you crying? Are you crying? Listen to me. Please, please, please. Don't even try to patronize me. No, don't pretend like you care about me or you don't know what I'm talking about. You know every damn thing that is happening. Alright? Wife, you know I care a lot about you. You know that. Hmm? You're my one and only wife. My only senior brother's wife, you know that. But it's okay. I... I... I'm sorry I'm not... I'm not called for the past two days. I know you're mad at me, but please, I'm so sorry. I just had a lot of busy schedules, you know, office things, work and all that. So I needed to clear them off before, you know. Listen to me, it's obvious your brother just wants to go for the test. He has refused. He told me he's not going for any medical checkup. So he's done on me right now that he definitely has something he's hiding from me. And I'm not here to put up with his nonsense. I am moving on with my life. I've made up my mind and that's final. Wifey, 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 listen, listen, listen to me, please, can you just calm down, alright, okay, I'll be coming tomorrow, we're going to settle this whole thing, okay, okay, please, Trudy, listen to me, I do not care, I don't care, I am exhausted already, you just have to be patient, please, just be patient, please, okay, I beg you, it's, it's, it's Chudi that is talking to you. Eh? Wifey, wifey. Don't worry, everything will be sorted out, okay? Please. Alright, I, 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 want, I, want I want to hear you laugh so that I will cut the door. Trying to say I've not been carried to you. <laughs> you are, but not to this extent. You see, my brother is not getting this right. Well, the truth is, everybody can never be like me. <laughs> you know, I always care about you. I know. <laughs> is that what? What cracks my head is why would she even assume that there's something wrong with us? Since we got married, have I not been performing my duties as a husband? No, that she's not insinuating anything. She only wants to be cleared and assured that the poor of you past medical attendances of having children. That's, that's the one that gets me mad. Hmm. Why in this world will she even assume there's something wrong with us? Why? Don't I perform as your husband? Have you not been menstruating? No, that she's a woman. Two years of childlessness is like 200 years in her sight. And that gives her the right to go telling people to come talk to me in my house about this. Really? Well, I'm not people who. I am your younger brother. That makes us family. You are not the first person that has come to this house to discuss this, my friend. What is wrong with this woman? Why are you so desperate? I am not desperate. Point of correction. All right? If you have any skeleton in your cupboard, you better come clean and stop beating around the bush. Okay? Yes. Really? Yes. I am not going to see any doctor on this account. If you're not comfortable with waiting for God's time, that's the door. 
Use it. Oh yeah? I will use it. No, I will go! I will go! No, 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 Yes, brother. How? Okay, what is there in following your woman, your wife, to the hospital for a proper medical checkup, for a proper medical test? What is there? Why is she overflogging this medical issue? What if I go for that test and the doctor says there's nothing wrong with me? Now, at least her mind will be settled. As a man, you have to do what you ought to do. You live in she doesn't house. need me to go to the hospital for her mind to be at rest. I am her husband, and I have told her that there's nothing wrong with me. She doesn't need a doctor to tell her that. And I'll just stand there and listen to this. Oh, no, no, come on, come on, wifey. No, please wait now. I have spoken to my brother. He has no right to hit you or to beat you up. You are his wife, not a punching bag. No, Chidi. He wants me to leave his house for him. That I shall do. I'll be going back to my father's house. No, no, you're going nowhere. I've made up my mind. But I'm leaving. But I'm here begging you. I'm begging you to forget about everything. Let's move on. But Chidi, he said he's not going to see any doctor or whatsoever. So the best thing for me to do right now is to move on with my life. Wifey. I'll go back to my father's house. Wifey, you're not going anywhere. And you're not moving on with any life. Okay? I promise you, I've spoken to him and he will go for the checkup. Trust me. Trudy, I'm tired. I swear to God, I'm dead. No, 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 please, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Trust me. I, I, you know, I hate to see tears in your eyes. But I promise you, you have no reason to shed tears again in this marriage. Come on, please. Okay. It's okay. Please. 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 Don't cry. What did I do? Let, let, let somebody please just wake me up from this dream. Oh, God. You shouldn't wake up from the dream if you ask me. Yes. What are you saying? It's a sweet, sweet, sweet dream, baby. Would you, you're my elder brother's wife. What if you had walked into this place and caught the two of us? I know, but... There's no but. There is no but. I came to rescue my brother's marriage. I want to ruin it. <laughs> Listen to me. If you really want to rescue your brother's marriage, you should be ready for more of this experience. What, what are you even saying? Look, I came to rescue my brother's marriage. I want to ruin it. Very well then. If you really came to rescue, you should be ready for more of this experience. Sweet experience. What are you saying? <laughs> what has come over you, Ju? Oh my God! Can you stop already? Yes. <laughs> I thought by now she would have left the house before I came back. Why is she still here? Brother, why are you talking like that? Huh? Do you think it's easy to have a virtuous woman like you as a wife? You should be grateful to God he gave you a wife like Uchu. Then why does she go on and on with this childlessness issue? 
in just two years? Why is she so worked up? Brother, I just feel you're the one making a mountain out of this little ant hill. Yes. Go and see the doctor and leave the rest for God. What is this ridiculousness you all are going on about? Anyway, at least nobody's accusing me of being uh, uh, adulterous or infidelity or coming back home late or drunkenness. She should also be grateful she married a very, very good man like me. Brother, just try and be more romantic to your wife. Mm. What do you mean more romantic? I mean like... Making love to her. You know? Did she tell you I don't make love to her? Uh, no, I, 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 I... Well, I was just um, advising, like, be more romantic to your wife. She didn't say anything like that. Oh. Oh. Good of you have something worrying you. Whatever it is, just keep it away from me. Okay? Ramon is not everything. No. You're being too busy for this woman. Be more romantic. Bring out time for your wife. She loves you. You're really now a marriage counselor, isn't it? Uh, no, it's, um, I, I was just only looking out for you, the two of you. I mean, you're being joking. Please, let me handle my wife the way I deem fit. Okay? Weeks pregnant. No. No, don't tell you. You're joking. I am not. my superman listen no listen very attentive i'm just getting back home right now from the doctor's place and he has just confirmed to me that i am six weeks gone hey wow congratulations wifey <laughs> i'm so happy to hear this congrats yes baby we made it oh wow it's really 
cause for celebration, you know? Oh my god! I am I am so grateful for you. Like you came into my life at the right time to wipe away my tears. I can't thank you enough. You're such a god sent to me. Thank you. From my heart. Thank you. <laughs> What? My other brother's wife. Pregnant for me. This is ridiculous. See that God is wonderful. I kept telling you there was nothing wrong with us. I kept telling you not to worry your head. Are you not pregnant now? Is it not confirmed? Did I go to see any hospital? That's how I would have wasted my money on that doctor. Babe, do you know you can pretend for the whole of Africa? <laughs> Wait a minute. So you actually need needed this more than me. And you've been pretending, acting like I'm the mad one, the desperate one. What name did you not call me? Honey, I was not pretending. Man. I knew we were sound. I knew nothing was wrong with us, that God was going to give us our own child baby. at this time. Baby, why were you acting like, oh, 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 <laughs> hey, you are pushing By the so way, much. I'm going to be a father. So this calls for big celebration. Oh my God. <laughs> baby. God. Baby. What do you want me? <laughs> Honey? Surprise, surprise! <laughs> There's a check of 3 million naira for you. Go to the mall, go shopping, get anything you need to make yourself happy. This is my gift to you for getting pregnant. <laughs> my God. Baby! <laughs> You're so sweet. It's nothing. You see, once you put to bed, I'm going to give you a bigger gift. Oh, no. No, baby. I love you. I love, I love you. You. No. you just get ready. In fact, I'm going to take you shopping myself. Keep your check. Get ready. Let me prepare. I'll take you where you need. You get anything you want. Baby. Anything. Ah. Hurry up. Okay, baby. I'm ready soon. Chuli, listen to me. If there's any time for you to be happy, it should be now. Alright? You should be happy. And why should I be happy? Well, you should be happy because you finally restored joy, happiness, love, and what have you in your brother's marriage. So it's a thing of joy. Happiness that is built on lies and deceit. Would you listen? Do you know that each time I play back on those times that you scream under me in ecstasy, I feel guilty. Do you know that? Oh, wow. And do you also realize that those times are the reason? I mean, those times I scream under you in ecstasy, we sneak out to make some sweet love. And the reason I'm still in this marriage, these are the things that are still keeping me in this marriage, you don't know. You really do not know what you've been doing for us. Okay. Now that you're pregnant, what will happen now? Nothing. Absolutely nothing will happen. I mean, I have a friend who has four children for her husband from different men. Nobody knows anything she's still alive and she's still living happily with her husband talk more of me that is pregnant for my husband's blood brother same flesh and blood oh wow it still runs in the family still same thing so there's no big deal there i see no big deal at all oh true 
You forget that I am a man. I still have blood flowing inside of me. And I know the truth. It has nothing to do with naivety. What truth? What truth? Not like I, 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 am, I am cheating on him with an outsider. I mean, same blood, same flesh, same thing. Listen to me. Your brother has been so helpful to you. You know it. So if this is your only two way of paying him back, you should be happy you did. Listen, we no longer fight like, like cat and dog. All thanks to you. You don't know what you did for us. You are a godsend. I'm serious. Sweetheart, listen to me. I actually do miss you. <laughs> Hey, 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 stop it. Stop, just, just stop it. Wait. What? It's me, it's you, me. <laughs> Listen to me, darling. <laughs> what is your problem right now? Okay, you want me to? I know what it was. Stay away from me. Judy. <laughs> <laughs> You're kidding, right? <laughs> All those who turn around, who say the evil things about my son, who we'll come back? Who we'll come back and thank God with him? Amen. And they will know that God is marvelous. He never God is wonderful. He never and that he has done it. <laughs> yes. Sir. So how is my beautiful daughter-in-law? She's doing fine, Papa. Ah, well. How is my wife? She's good, Mama. And the baby in the womb? Oh, my daughter is kicking great. Ah, who told this baby? <laughs> because I know that's what I prayed for. <laughs> that is a pleasant news. In fact, you have made my day with this news. Thank hey. you, Papa. In fact, I want you both to do something for me very important. What is that? I want you to help me thank Chudi, my brother. Do you know that since Chudi stepped his feet into my house, mm -hmm. there's been peace. Mm -hmm. All the disagreements I've been having with my wife has ceased. Mm -hmm. He spoke to us, he advised us, and since then we have become Romeo and Juliet. Mm -hmm. In wow. fact, it was in this atmosphere of love that he brought about <coughs> that the fruit of the womb came. Hey! hey thank God! <laughs> In fact, I will thank God for his life. After, my wife does not joke with Chudi now. Oh. Before she even serves me food, she must make sure Chudi is well taken care of. You see? <laughs> That's how much she values him in that house. You see? <laughs> one need him more. One now, my car. One now, my Yes, mama, one now, my car. That, you see, they said blood is thicker than water. Exactly. Of course. Eh? Chudi has proven it. Hmm. The way he dots on my wife, makes sure everything is okay in the house, advises us when we have an issue. He's the one to bring this person and this person together and there's a talk. He always has a way of intervening and bringing peace. Hey! hey. hey. He's one God sent. <laughs> He's God sent. He's God sent. I'm Sorry. happy. Hey! Huh. Hi! Hi!
<laughs> I know. Something. I know everybody was weak after that. You'll be going back to Potaka today, right? Oh, yes. Um, I will. Um, once I just wake up, I'll just take my bath and rock okay, the road. That means I'll talk to you when I get to work, when you're ready to leave. I have to rush to the office now. I have a board meeting to attend. Okay? All right, brother. All right. So have a safe trip as you go. I'll call you. Okay. <laughs> See, last night was heaven on earth. And let me be honest with you, I do not want you to go to Potter Court again. Please stay with us permanently. Excuse me. I already told my brother I'm leaving like, for Potter Court today. Sweetheart, it doesn't matter. You can just say, oh, you changed your mind, something came up. A lot of things to say, you know. <laughs> Are you kidding me? So, who will help me run my office in Potter Court? Is it me you're asking? Please, just one more night. <sighs> okay, let me make it a little bit more easier for us. That same thing that happened last night can still happen in the daytime before I hit the road. Okay, I get it. Yeah. This is you asking me to come to daddy. Come through. Come on. Honey, honestly, this trip is very important. It's essential that I travel. Just understand and bear with me. It's just for two weeks. You, you see what I'm talking about? No, look at it. You are not a romantic man at all. No, you are not romantic. I mean, your wife is about to put to bed to your son, your son for that matter. You want to leave me in this condition and travel? Sweethearts, listen. The only romantic man in this world is that man who can provide for his wife. Money makes love sweeter and sweeter, okay? I'm not going to stay all the year out there. I'm just going for a business trip and I'll be back before you know it. Just two weeks. Let me go out there and make this money, Piccolo. And leave me alone in this condition. No, you're not going to be alone. I mean, there are mates in this house. There's a security. There are people to assist you to stuff. Sweetheart, all these people you are mentioning are not going to be there when I need you. They are. They live. I could even ask Judy to come over and stay with you for the two weeks I'll be away. And I know he will oblige me that. Wow. You want to ask your brother to come? Yes. Oh, your brother should come and stay in Gap for you. Meaning, 
you should also do the other one. <laughs> Stop, Joy. I'm not talking about doing the do. I know you can endure that for two weeks. All I'm saying is that he comes around and be in the house in case there's an emergency or you get into labor in the middle of the night. That's all. You are not me, my darling. So you wouldn't know if I need to do. Okay, what happened is this. I'm going to do enough do before I travel. <laughs> so at least you have somebody, something to hold body with. <laughs> Oh, oh, my waist. Sorry. Mm. Sorry. Mm, 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 mm. This is, this. You are holding me too tight. Sorry, sorry. Oh, my waist. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Mm. okay. Okay. It's too much. You're oh. not rubbing it well. Oh. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. Sorry, 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 okay. Wait, no, don't carry me! Okay, okay, okay. okay. Uh, 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 now you come down now. I'm dying now. Easy, 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 Sorry. 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 To be called your wife again. Please forgive me. I, I traded on the wrong path, I know. Please. Forgive me, please. It's my fault, please. I'm begging you. There is nothing to forgive. Nothing. No, oh, please, please. Chief will too. No, 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 please! No! Please, 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 please! No, there please! There is no need living. My sins have found me out. I was on my way to this place to give your wife a third child. When I had this accident, that rendered me useless. Chief Untu, no, please. Pull the trigger! Please, Kill me! No, Kill me! No, please, it's me. It's me. Kill me. Please. Kill me. Please. 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 
Brother, kill me! Kill me! Kill me! Thank you, Doctor. I have come to collect the test of the results I took yesterday. I hope it's ready. Of course, they are ready. Good. Um, I hope there's nothing wrong with me. Can I father a child? See, my brother, I am surprised at your results. Because I remember I told your wife to bring you for medical checkup, but you didn't come. The truth of the matter is that I won't lie to you. You are suffering from low stomach cramps. Yes. That's not possible, Doctor. What are you talking about? I have erections. I make love to my wife all the time. I ejaculate every time. How can you say I have low sperm count? My brother, I know you can. But as it stands now, you, you won't be able to produce the, the, the quantity of sperm that can get the woman pregnant. Yes, let me tell you something. There are percentage of semen that a woman needs for her to be pregnant. Once you're not able to get it, forget it, my brother. Your wife can't get pregnant. That's true. Oh. Doctor, does he have a cure? Of course he does. See, I will prescribe some medications for you and I'll guide you on how to go about meeting your woman. Oh, thank you so much. I believe you'll get the desired results. Thank you so much. One more thing, please. What's the cause of this? Well, most of the times it could be as a result of um, mistreated and untreated STD. You don't have to worry yourself, my brother. Everything will be fine. Destroy the trust by myself. I'm not worthy. 
to stand before you. I have destroyed the trust by myself. Oh, I'm not worthy to stand before you. Because Come on, pretty. Why are you doing this? I've been trying to talk to you, but... Okay, just get into the car. Let me take you to wherever you're going. What is it? What is it? I, I, I... I don't want you. Can't you understand? How can you say such a thing? How can you say you don't want me? I've been trying to talk to you. But you have intentionally and vehemently refused to give me attention. Why? I don't get you. Does that mean I don't have the right to choose what I want and what I don't want? Of course you have every right. But let it be something worth it. How can you say you don't want a man like me? Does it make sense? Okay, what if I'm married? Oh, no, no, Flora, you can't be married. You can't be. All I know about you is you leave your brother and the wife up the street. So how come you're married? Okay, fine. I have a serious relationship and I don't want to cheat. Does that make sense now? Oh, no. Can yeah. I go? Yes, it makes a lot of sense. But the truth is, giving out your number for if to a friend to always check up on you will not cause any harm. That is not cheating. Come on, stop looking at me like that. Please, your digits. Please. Why would you talk like that? <laughs> when I tried to get you to your attention, you didn't even you didn't even want to listen to me. You were the one to stop you here. Very strong. Come on, do you know how many times I've tried to you know talk to you, make advances at you, and you bet you reject my advances. I mean. They will not understand. A man who wants something goes for it desperately. <laughs> you will not understand. <laughs> you would. <laughs> okay. So how are you today? No, I won't have to stop you. This time around, I have to pick you up with my car and we go to somewhere very cool and cozy where we can sit down and talk. <laughs> very humble and nice one at least. Well, presently I'm out of town. I can only be at my brother's place. I actually came to see them. But uh, most hopefully, I should be back to Potsdam Point on Sunday evening. So, is it a date? Okay. See you on Sunday evening then. Alright, take care of me. So why were you rejecting me when you knew you had no man in your life? Because I know the kind of heart I have. I've been heartbroken before, so I prefer staying alone, married to my dude, than get involved in another relationship that will break my heart. Dude? Yeah. Why do you do? Because I know the kind of body I have. I have high libido, so I want it around me at all times. 
Wow. <laughs> wow. You know, I I love the fact that you're very transparent. Yeah, I'm a very transparent person. That's why I feel very bad anytime I take it for granted. And I hate lies. I hate it with passion. Then if that be the case, and that means you are with the right person. I hope you're not here to take me for granted. No, I'm not. Okay. Cheers. So what about the wives? Those wives, their husbands are outside the country. God knows I can never be there. Oh. So are you trying to say that if you get married today and your husband happens to get a very good job, good paying job abroad, you will not allow him to go? Well, it's either we go abroad together for the job or the marriage is over. I can't be here answering a married woman when my husband is there, flirting with girls. I can't. Once I'm married, my husband should be able to satisfy me in bed. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> what? Why are you laughing? I, I, I actually got the drift. <laughs> okay. Sexual needs. <laughs> So read everything. So this is the end of me. My power cannot stand anymore. What have I gotten myself into? Sunday. 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 That's all, guy. Take me to the post, man.
What is it? What happened? Why not in school? What are you doing here? I'm fine. I'm fine. You're tired of what? What happened now? What kind of life is this? Huh? Oh, God. Oh, God. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Listen to me. I know. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Is this how a student is supposed to be dressed? Is it not? It's okay, calm down. I know, I know our parents disappointed us. No, 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 no. I've been never, I've been, I've never disappointed us. I've never disappointed you. No, 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 no. I'll make plenty money to take good care of you, okay? I promise. Stop crying. I've not paid my school fees. Oh, my God. Don't worry. Other students are in the classroom. Don't worry. Don't worry. I've never eaten. Stop now. It's not better than your father. It's okay. I will give you. I will give you money for excuses. Once I come back, I will give you more money for excuses. I promise. Once I come back home, I will give you more money for excuses. Okay? Just take this money. Just take this money. Go and buy bread and pure water. Just take this money. Go and buy bread and pure water. Please. Take, 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 take. Have you? You know we're not eating right, ba? What is our offense? No, look at you. You drop out out of school to make sure I go to school. I need to put in your uniform. Look at me, look at me. Judy. They have to sew this uniform. They have to, Judy, they have to please, stop, 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 please, 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 please. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'm tired. Take, take, take. take. Oh, no. Collect money from me, take. Don't take. Wow, what are you? Yeah, what are Two hundred naira. How many you want? Twenty. How much? How much? What is it? It's chud. Chud. What? 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 Come, 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 let's go. Come, 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 I will teach you. Judy, what happened? You have to, ma'am. What happened? Talk to me, what happened? Talk to me. I was passing. Okay. So, she called me to say the other for her. So, so, so then what happened? What happened? I don't know when I broke out to him. Which thing? Ah. Why are you on me? Why are you on me? Auntie, I beg. I beg. I beg. So my younger brother, this I beg. Forgive him, I beg. Now you have ring. Uh, yes. Make a bell. Yes. Thank you. This mirror that he broke. Yeah. 
hope you don't say that they're still at the price of 500 naira. You get money to pay Abby? I don't get the money like this, like this now, I beg. I don't get the money. I beg. Don't worry. Back, you don't need to pay with money again. Let's say you find his wife. Go, Sabina, come on, Abby. Ati. Ati, I beg. I beg. I never, I never, I never do this thing. I still be begging. I beg. You go to one today now. I beg. 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 My mama, my, my tell you, don't let you money to send us go to school. <laughs> Did you talk more of to bring money to come pay for this meal? Uh, I beg now. Nah. I don't say you be a good woman. You get good hearts now. Nah. You don't like get money to pay for my meal. Uh, you don't want to do that one. No, we'll choose one now. Hi, we'll oh, choose one. Oh, I beg now. Wait, now this night got bread. I beg now. Oh, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. It's not too deep now. Too deep. I beg, I beg. It's not a small boy now. It's not a small boy now. Chuji, you need to be careful, please. You need to be careful with this, this kind of place. What did she do to you? What did she do to you? Question. Let's go, John. Stand up. Carry Peter, let's go. Jesus. What is it? Why are you shouting? Next time I'm urinating. My team will be pinning me. I see if it's on fire. Timo. Hiya. Nto. Eh? It's gonna real. Eh? It's gonna real. Hi, you have contacted Gonorrhea and told me. Chimo, Gonorrhea. That's a shower girl. That's a shower girl. How you doing this? Jesus. You have to treat it before it gets out of hand. You have to treat it. I don't have money. I don't have money. Can't tell me you don't have money. Look at my younger, my, my younger brother. I, I, I need to take care of him. I don't have money. You have to treat it. I said I don't have money. Gonorrhea. Gonorrhea. I don't have money. I don't have money. I don't have money. I don't have money. Oh, Jesus Christ. Nto? Eh? This is Gonorrhea now. No, now. Stop now. Stop now. You get a, you get a, a play. Which child is Gonorrhea again? Stop now. It's Gonorrhea, Nto. Gonorrhea. You have to go and treat it. Me, treat Gonorrhea. Eh? Now you have to go and treat it. Which child is Gonorrhea? Hey! I don't have money. Let's go, please. Hey, yeah. I'm going to go. It was all because of you that I got into this whole mess. Now this is how you're paying me back? <sighs> Everything I was doing for him was for his success. All I wanted for him was happiness and growth and establishment. Only for him to turn around and stab me in the back. Nambiko, stop crying. What your brother did is abominable. It's a very grievous sin. But I don't want you to see it from that angle. I want you to see it from the angle that I'm seeing it. Mama, what angle are you seeing it from? Hey, what do you go on now? I am speechless. Can't you see that this is devil's handbook? Is it not only two of you? So soon, Abu. He wants you people to fight each other so that we, your parents, Will die of heartbreak. But if we should pay him back for the gravity of the sin that he has committed against you, he deserves to die. But he who kills his brother has killed his own soul. Even one man in Mobugu become one. It's a shame. A dirty story and as such should not be heard outside. 